It's like when you do the wave. Oh, yeah, good idea. Leave the lemonade. lemonade. We're in the frame. We're out of the frame. Lemonade. We're in the frame. We're out of the frame. Lemonade. So it's Leroy Butler and Robin Yount. Robin Yount's had the Robinade for a while. Old school lemonade going to charity. And I now, have no idea. Here I we go. Know. But now I'm up. <laughs> I really like this. It's a uh, cardboard paper ring, very recyclable, good for the earth. I yeah. like that. Don't ever give Melissa anything that's not recyclable. Blah, blah. That's the that's the lesson. Melissa yeah. is single-handedly saving the earth, so <laughs> that's why we keep her around. And it's really cool seeing all of these players that have been just such a part of our great uh, city and great having Robin Yacht doing things like this because we like the beverages too. And you're going to love drinking it year round probably. I mean like a vodka lemonade you could probably drink. Sure, you think oh summertime but yeah. you can drink that year round. I like that it says a lot of the nostalgic things on here like celebrate like you scored. and Swing, swing for the fences! <laughs> so anyway, uh, really cool that, wow. I wow. feel like I'm at, you know when they announce people at the Bucks game and they're like Ch -ch -ch <laughs> do it, do it, do it, do it. Oh, cripes. That's good. Oh, it doesn't taste like vodka at all. It just tastes like nice, sweet, delicious lemonade. Have you had that Leap vodka? I have not. No, I haven't. No, not, this is my first time. Now I have. Thank you, Leroy. This you want a tasty. nice, pleasantly mixed. It's very light, mm -hmm. and it's not like crazy alcohol flavoring. It's a lot of the lemonade, which is old school lemonade, and mm -hmm. so it's the lemonade you grew up on, really. But it's like, um, I like it because it's like a bubbly lemonade. Lemonade usually isn't carbonated, and this is. It I is, like yeah, I, didn't, I wasn't expecting it to be carbonated. It's sort of like a Mike's Hard Lemonade, but mm -hmm. it has more flavor than a Mike's Hard Lemonade. I agree. No offense to Mike. You're doing a good job, Mike. Mike, you you're did the old good. school. You're the original, but they're just kind of creeping in on it, and Milwaukee's probably going to like that because they like the colors. They've got the nice brewer's colors going on here, and it's tasty right here, made in Wisconsin. I like that. Yeah, it's almost like the, the gold from the green and gold, too. So they're kind of just going with the lemonade. It's very classy looking. Yeah, and I was saying, it looks like you get a little trading card. <laughs> I know, <laughs> I was looking at that. You get the little the autograph. Signature. Yep, from Leroy and Robin. And um, do you have a favorite sports athlete? Giannis. Sorry. Giannis, okay. Yeah, So, but you put Giannis in on here, it could be like, Mean mug and leaping lemonade. Oh, I love it. <laughs> the mean mug and root beer. Mug root beer. Yeah. Like mug root beer. Ooh, yeah. Spracker Ooh. and Giannis put together. Hey. Mug or root beer. We have lots of ideas, Giannis. Hit us up. <laughs> Can you tag Giannis in this video? <laughs> sure. Yeah, but this is, this is really sweet. I just got it at um, Otto's. You know, it's around, but I'm sure it said most major <sighs> grocery stores. So I'm sure pick and save. Sendix or whatever. It, it's easy. It's like 10 bucks for a six pack. So Did you get carded? No. Ooh, do you this, get offended? All this you know? gray hair up in there. She's like, she must have grandkids. Sure, miss. I, so do you get offended when you don't get carded? Would you have been happier if you would have gotten carded for this? No, I think I'm still at the point in my life where I'm annoyed if I get carded. Really? Yeah. Okay. Because I don't want to take the extra, like, I know I don't look like I'm 19 years old, so I'm good. Do you least, ever so. get carded? No. I mean, well, I, if it's like somewhere obvious where they have to, mm -hmm. but maybe once a year, which is sad. Yeah. It's sad. Yeah, yeah, I probably would not have gotten carded for this, you know. But it's really good. Like, it's only, it's 11.15, so it's like almost lunchtime. It's going down really easy. Yeah. I know, it really I is. I feel like I shouldn't finish this because I'm at work. But I'm starting to think about what goes well with the vodka lemonade. What kind of food goes well with this? Mm. A hot dog, a brat, a burger, like any kind of cookout picnic food, like pulled pork. Oh, pulled pork there we go. Now. Pulled pork sandwich with one of these. But thank you, Robin Yout, and thank you, Leroy Butler, for doing this. I feel you like we can leap leap higher because of this. If you Have you ever met Leroy Butler? I did. If you haven't... Where do you live? Because it's not Wisconsin. Like, you could probably find that man. He's been anywhere. everywhere. I bet he lists his property out wherever he lives. I know he lives in Wisconsin. I bet it's a public property that he just says, come on, yeah, I'll find yeah, whatever you Yeah, of course. Yeah, he, yeah, very generous. I met Robin Young, too, so he's very nice. What? How'd you meet him? 
Well, because I used to ride my bike. I lived near County Stadium, and I would ride my bike down to stomping get autographs. Yep. My old stomping grounds. And Robin Yount, the secret was he came out through the center field gate. All the other players would come out the other gate during the main en- uh, by the main entrance. Oh. And so Robin Yount would literally drive his, it was like an old Chevy Corsica. It wasn't a fancy car or anything. He rolled down the window, and he would sign all of the cards. That's he was the, the nicest man. He was, I still have the autographs in my attic, and my kids love looking at them. Paul Molitor did the same thing. I love that. They were so nice. Do you think he still drives a Corsica? Or you Maybe. Think he's like made it up to like. You remember the Corsicas? Dodge Neon. No. <laughs> right, Dodge Neon. <laughs> Way to go, Robin. I think you can afford a Mercedes by now. But yeah, this is really cool. Yeah. I'd say definitely a plus. Uh, grab it for your next little cookout or whatever. You're grilling in the winter. Just have one of these. It's fine. And if it was really hot, I, would you be done with the first one already? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, they're very easy going down. It's nice. It doesn't have that no lemon that vodka can kind of give you sometimes. It doesn't have you could chug this if you wanted to. I could very right now. easily. Right now. It's a uh, six point. 7% alcohol. So you got a salad of 4% in you right now. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>